Krill are the most abundant and important species of animal in all of Antarctica. With their little bent appendages near their head, they filter the diatoms out of the seawater, and with their pulsing swimmerettes, they push themselves along. As they feed on microscopic plants, in turn, krill are the primary food source for most of the penguins and seals. I enjoyed observing this single krill captive in a water glass, but what I really wanted to see was schools or swarms of krill actually feeding along the edge of the sea ice. While working with the SEAL research team, I was able to lean out of their inflatable Zodiac and holding my handheld underwater video camera, I attempted to find krill living on the edges of the ice. The seawater was a minus 1.5 degrees C and it was a bit of a challenge holding the camera steady with my bare hands held under the water. But my technique worked. Here were the krill living along the edge of the sea ice feeding on the algae that were actually clinging to the ice itself. Some of the sea ice appears to be a brownish yellow. This is the uh, algae living right inside the brine channels within the ice. This swarm of krill was using a undercut section of the ice as a protective hiding place while they grazed upon the algae on the ice. The scene reminded me a little bit of my experiences of watching shrimp and fish working along the edge of a coral reef. Except here, instead of coral, it was sea ice. The krill didn't seem to be bothered by the presence of me, my arms, or my camera in their world. All in all, it was a very successful krill safari. This is Jeff Penniston, a Polar Trek teacher for 2008 on the Amundsen Sea in Antarctica.